Hey guys, what is going on? Rocks with Gaming here, and today I'm here to show you on how to get coloured names in your tab in Minecraft Bucket Server. Now, the only plugins you will need for this is your group manager and essentials, which everyone will have with Bucket. Everyone has it, so that's all you need. Essentials, just you know, you know how to install essentials. I'm not going to go over that. There's plenty of tutorials, but I'm making this just because I know how many people don't actually know. So right now I'm actually on my server um, with my mini game which I'm creating, um, which I'll go over a bit later in the actual video too. So to get a colour tab, you need to go into your server file. Um, this is exactly the same on Windows. Don't say, "Oh, I don't have com st start dot command." Just go straight in your plugins, go in essentials, and you will see config dot yml. And um, if you open that up you will see lots of different stuff. So if you hear my door. Um, notes, you don't read this is just note about it. The, that little hashtag if you're wondering means that this isn't part of the config, it just tells you what it is. So anyway, you want essentials global which should be at the top. Text edit equals freaking notepad. So don't tell me I don't have text edit either, Windows people. So a colour between zero and nine or eight F set to none to disable. So this is what colour opt names are. So as you can see, if I say hi, hi, because I am op, I'm red. If I de -op myself, I'd be white. Basic. So if I want that to be um, five, if I save that now, and I reload my server, and I say hi, I am now, you know, purple, which is very friggin' majestic. So we're going to go on how to actually... Um, Ignore, we want to ignore this start off because we want the um, the group's software to actually display that name that you want for that group. I, uh, unless you want it red, then you don't have to do this. But basically what we're going to set this is we're going to set this to none. And that will disable op's name colour. So, if you're op, it doesn't matter. So nickname prefix, I have set this to none again. Default is that. Um, I want my donators to nickname themselves without the little squiggly mark because I don't like it. I just think it doesn't look professional. You can have this whatever you want. You could say nickname prefix Nick, like that if I can spell it, Nick, Nick, equals, I saw this done before, or at dash, and then that. So if we save that now and reload our server again, kill myself, fight slash Nick, Hello, like that, oh, hello. If I go hi, my nick is nick equals hello. So, as you can see, that's the prefix before the actual name. If I nick off, my nickname is now off. Off, and I go hi, my name is back white because I've disabled the ops name color. So, now what we're going to do is to actually get on with actually getting the tab. So, here you will see when this option is enabled, the tab player list will be updated with this display name. Now, this is means it will make the name, this will stop essentials from making it white. It will allow the groups to manage what the name color is going to be. So, all you're just going to do, change player list. You're going to freaking remove that sexy little thing and you're going to set that to true. Now, if I save this and slash reload this slash kill myself just because the plugin decides to actually hit me there because I'm still coding it um, basically if I do slash nick and I put myself as a color because right now I'm white let's go Ryan so my nick equals that so if I do tab it actually says nick space Lewis but if I disable the nick I just leave it as that, and I save again, and I slash reload, slash kill, low, and slash hi, ho, to update my name, and, or slash anything, that will update your name, like that. Um, I don't have group manager enabled on the server at the moment, that's why the colour text is like that, because I'm nicknamed that colour, but it won't happen if you have the 
uh, group manager because group manager sets the color they chat anyway, which I'll go which I'll go over on another tutorial. So as you can see now, if I nickname myself, I don't know, purple, if I can actually do the right hand, five, Lewis underscore Ryan. As you can see now, and I say hi because you've got to say hi in the chat for it to update in the tab sometimes. My nick is Lewis Ryan. Not Nick, my Nick isn't Lewis Ryan, my name's actually Lewis Ryan, but it's pink. So now I'm going to go over in Group Manager how you would actually colour their names with the group. Because if you don't want them to have their nickname, obviously you want them to have colours on with their automatically. So let's get on with that. So what we're going to go ahead and do, I do not think I got um, Group Manager on this server, no. So I'll go into my other server that which is, uh, I'll just go in this one into the configure this. So, group manager. Sorry about this, I don't have group manager installed on this server, but I'll show you how to do it. And we go to world, world, and your groups. This will come up in notepad, notepad++, plus plus, whatever the hell you like, okay? Uh, if I just open that again. Right, so... Basically, what's going to happen, these are the groups, You've already, you know how to set them up, watch a tutorial. So, groups owner, um, I'll just do this one for now. Basically, I'll explain just the prefix, because that's for what, what the tutorial's about. Um, the prefix is basically, and six is yellow, so that'll set that yellow. And B is um, cyan, or blue. As light blue, whatever the hell you want to call it, and that will set that blue. And six again will set the bracket yellow. So now we're onto this bit here. That means there's no the name will be coloured white, nothing. Okay. If you do that, there will be a space between the prefix and the name. So a lot of servers don't even know how to do that. And another thing is if you do and four or and five, I don't know, or and B that will color the user's name. Um, I, don't, I don't really need to show you this, I've just explained it, so I'm not going to waste time on doing that. And that will set the, the player's name. This basically is where the player's name starts. So that's the start of the player's name. So that's telling group manager to cut if, if essentials config isn't already um, dealing with the tab, to set that player's name blue what am I on about to set if essentials isn't dealing with that player's name to set it blue and then in the tab if essentials isn't using isn't using um isn't you know you know if we just disabled it to me for some reason that didn't work okay so yes so that's how you get a color tab I've gone really in depth with this tutorial I hope I've explained everything the way you like it so we've covered, um, let's just recap, we've covered how to, the global settings for the chat for essentials dealing with um, chat with colours for nicknames and tab. We've also covered group manager on how to put a space between the prefix, what, what the colours do in the prefix to explain them to even newer players. And we've also gone over how to make the colours name so-and-so in the rank in group manager.